Hi, this is Shraddha. Welcome back to my channel. I make travel vlogs and in this vlog, I'll be sharing day two of Hampi. So, let's get started. On day two of Hampi, we went to the other side of Tungabhadra River to explore Anigundi, Anjanadri and Sanapur Lake. Now we are heading to Navrindavan, which is located on an island in Tungabhatra River at Anigundi. To reach there, you can catch a ferry either from Gangavati side or Hampi side. In Navrindavan, there are shrines dedicated to Ranganath and Hanuman. It is on this island that Vyasa Raja in his earlier avatar as Pradhat had meditated to get rid of his dosh of getting his father Hiranyakashyap killed by Lord Narasimha. प्रत्येक घर एनसेस्टर्स ने दिल डिटेल छोटे छोटे आइटम पूजा करते होते ना जो घरी है पूजा की पद्धत 
लग्न बिग्न सग कन्या लोग रुद्राक्ष मंडपा लक्ष्मी नरसिम्हा टेम्पल एंड गणेशा टेम्पल There is a cave nearby which might have been a place of penance for the ancient sages. Further from this terrace you can spot the footprints engraved in stone and it is said to be of Lord Ram. Also this marks the spot from where he hid behind a tree and killed Bali. Further ahead is a cave which is believed to be the first meeting spot of Ram and Anjaneya. At the top of the hill is a temple dedicated to Hanuman. According to Hindu mythology, he was born to Anjana. Thus, Hanuman is also known as Anjaneya, and his birthplace is Anjaneya. You can easily spot this hill from a distance, as the temple at the hilltop is whitewashed and a white trail of steps which are leading all the way to the top.
marks the end of day 2 in Hampi. If you like this vlog, then don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.